Good morning and welcome to Elevation Church. We are so glad you are here with us today. Take a look at the eConnect card on the inside of the handout you received. The card is multi-purpose. If you are new here, if you would like to talk to Pastor Ryan, or would like to get more involved, please fill out your information and drop it in the offering bucket so we know you are here. You can also hand it in to the Welcome Center on your way out. The second session of DNA is happening after service today. For those who have signed up, please meet behind the eKid check-in area at 1140. This is a reminder to all parents who have children eKids. Please keep the security tag given to you when you check your child in to eKids. Not only will you need it to pick up your child after service, but also if your youngin needs you during service, your security number will pop up on the screen. So please have them available to view at all times, 24-7. Also, we are so grateful for all of our wonderful volunteers that work in the eKids area. They help make our children's ministry so fantastic. Please help us bless them by picking up your children after service in a timely fashion. Oh, and a side note, all unsupervised children after service will be given a free kitten and tons of espresso. Water baptism is happening on October 23rd after service. If you would like to be baptized, please sign up at the Welcome Center after service. Join Sharon Peterson on October 10th at the founding gates of our city here in Green Bay. The meetup time is at 6 p.m. at the Metro Public Boat Launch. This will be a time to worship and declare the abundant life that our Almighty God has for us. Worship Him is meeting at Mike and Lisa Fink's house in Ashwaubenon on October 14th at 7 p.m. Come expecting to encounter our King. You can contact them at 920-264-41. And last, but certainly not least, the Destiny Conference. Hi, I'm Marty Pronova, and I'm one of the lead pastors here at Lifehouse Humboldt in Humboldt County, California. I'm so excited to be coming to Wisconsin in October for the conference. The Bible says that we are individually members of one another, but part of us being able to be strong for one another is us discovering who we were created to be. In our time together, we're gonna to discover our why so we can lend strength to any environment that we are a part of so that we can see His kingdom come, His will be done in Wisconsin as it is in heaven. for listening and, and enjoy, enjoy the, the rest, rest of the, the service. service. Hi everybody. About three weeks ago I had a bad kidney infection and actually prior to that I went to the doctor and they gave me the wrong kind of antibiotics and I had the worship team pray over me that my kidney infection would be gone and that I wouldn't be as drowsy because the antibiotics were making me really really drowsy and the team was praying over me and Phil actually came up and he was touching my back and praying over me with the whole team and he could feel like the presence. <laughs> I didn't feel anything like crazy, but I just believed that my kidney infection will be totally gone. And after a few days, it was all fine. I didn't have any kidney problems after that. What I've just been putting together recently was for about three months, I've actually been having bad digestive problems. I was trying different things, like I tried taking out gluten out of my diet, and I tried dairy and other things, and even when I had a completely clean diet, I was still having these problems. So as they were praying for my kidneys, I realized that after, after that point, I had a completely fine digestive system. Like everything was just working perfectly. So not only did Jesus heal my kidneys in that problem, but also I have absolutely no issues and that's that was two weeks ago. So praise God. That's that's my my praise report.